three weeks after receiving a kidney transplant, a Madera County woman is recovering and happy to be off dialysis. We first told you about Kim Campisi back in April and how she needed dialysis four times a day to stay alive. Fox 26 reporter Rich Rodriguez talked to Kim for the first time since her surgery, plus her friend who donated that kidney. I'm alive. I'm not on dialysis. Uh, I just am trying to get used to the like anti rejection and immune suppressant medications. I, I take like 30 pills a day. Kim Campisi is now three weeks into her recovery after undergoing kidney transplant surgery at UC Davis Medical Center in Sacramento. Her new routine includes lab work twice a week and a weekly visit to the med center. Taking all those pills is wearing her down. As for me, it's getting harder because of the medications. They want to hit me real hard in the beginning so I don't reject the new kidney. Um, and, and they told me that. They pre-warned me and said the first month's going to be really hard for you. Campisi is no stranger to medical challenges. Back in April, her kidneys were operating at 5%. She needed dialysis four times a day to stay alive. She was on the kidney transplant list four years before a friend, Christy Peterson, applied online. I had talked to my husband and I just felt compelled. I just felt uh, God was calling me to do that. And so we started the process and step by step we were a match. You know, I just put it in God's hands and just believed that it would work out. Once her recovery is complete, Campisi would like to get back to work. Well, I mean, eventually I'd like to go back to work. You know, I was a paramedic at one point in my life. Um, so I'd like to get back to working. And Campisi and her partner, Andrea, have three children. She wants to spend more time with the family and not be stuck to an IV pole. Her advice to people waiting for a transplant, never give up. Rich Rodriguez, Fox 26 News. Want to see more stories like this? Watch Great Day weekday mornings from 5 to 10 and Fox 26 News at 10.